Hello, this is Mr. Rollins checking in. Just uh, wanted to, well, I guess at this point you've made it, okay, to the Scientific Process Lab. This is a lab we started last year at Pontiac Middle School. So what you do here is your objective is to design an experimental investigation applying the scientific process. Your experiment must be a fair test, okay? It must be something that we can test. Um, I mean, there's plenty of things, you know, build a rocket ship that's to, to fly the moon. That's not something we could do for example. So your task right here is to develop your own question to be investigated pending my approval. I'm open to any idea, but I have to say yes. Uh, you can create a question based on the topics below. Once your question is approved by me, you must apply the scientific uh, process, okay? Hypothesis, investigation, variables. This all has to go into that to investigate that question. The options you have the paper towel absorption, which I can help you find, and you could develop the question. Paper, paper airplanes. The plant gizmo is off the table because we've already done that, so we'll just delete that right now. Seed germation is a gizmo as well. How is heart rate affected by exercise? How does cold water, does cold water freeze faster than hot water? Would have to be done, this probably would have to be done at home. The freezer here is very small. Reaction time gizmo, the effect of an environment on a new life form, which is also gives me, or you can design your investigation. I do have some ideas. Uh, I have some kits that I haven't used. I have a bacteria swab, which I've done last year. So if you're interested in that, you have to design a test for the school and you test it out and we swab it and we see what grows as a result of it. I have a tap water kit and I have GMO, genetically modified seeds versus real seeds. That takes a little longer because they have to grow. So then we have to wait on that one. But the tap water and the viruses, uh, the, the swabs could work. You do need to work with somebody else on this investigation. Uh, I look forward to this. If you have any questions, please come see me, but make sure you've watched this before you start. Uh, there's two parts to the lab. Uh, this, you have the regular lab report, which will be graded by me. It needs all the parts. You need to have your hypothesis, your procedure, your materials, your data, and a conclusion. Okay, and all these materials that you need can be found on the Canvas homepage. So if you're in there, let's bring that up. I'm in the Canvas homepage. I go right to Science Lab Materials. This will help you in every step of the lab report. Okay, if you have any questions, let me know, and good luck.